a very good morning to dear students now i am welcoming you in the class of maths now uh, you know your syllabus and according to the syllabus this is the first chapter which is coming in your exam that be my multiple i'll be your factor this chapter will come in your exam you have done it earlier also not today we are going to revise it only now first is factor what is factor a factor is a number divides it without leaving a remainder now the properties and uh, children this is a request this is request to you that if your work is still not completed complete it because any time i can call on your number and ask for the work so you have to complete your all the copy work also so complete it and revise this chapter again now be my multiple i'll be a factor factor is a factor a number divides it without leaving a remainder now the properties are means no remainder will be left that is factor One is a factor of every number. Every number is a factor of itself. A factor of a number is smaller than or equal to the number. I have just taught you earlier also. So today we are going to do revise only. Smart smallest factor of a number is one. The greatest number of factor is the number itself. A number has limited number of factors. Now multiple. now the multiple is a number exactly divisible by a number if any number is completely divisible by that number that is properties are every number is a multiple of 1 every number is a multiple of itself a multiple of number is greater than or equal to the number a number has an uncountable number of multiples there is no largest number of multiple now this is called the multiple now first five multiples of now if we are saying that uh, what is the first five multiple of 15 so you have to just read the table of 15 till how much five multiples you have to know so till five you have to 5 15 ones are 15 15 twos are 30 15 threes are 45 15 fours are 60 15 fives are 75 this is the first five multiples of 15 according like that all the number we can find out right first multiples of the each of the following digit not 10 multiples you have to first 10 multiple multiple uh, multiples you have to write down of the 4 and 5 means of the table of 4 you have to count it till 4 tens of 40 and you have and table of 5 you have to count it till 5 tens of 50 Now four ones are four, four twos are eight, four threes are twelve, four fours are sixteen, four fives are twenty, four sixes are twenty-four, four sevens are twenty-eight, four eights are thirty-two, four nines are thirty-six, and four tens are forty. According to that, fifty you have to do. Now you can see here you have to find out only multiples, but here you have to find out the common multiples. What are the common multiples? Whatever the common, you have to write it down. So in both, you have to first of all. write down first 10 multiples after that find out which is common so 20 and 20 is common in both of them and 40 and 40 is common so write down common multiple is 20 and 40 now this is a first 10 multiples and how to find out the common multiples these are the common multiples of 4 and 5 first now this same question first of all multiples of 2 and 6 till 10 digit after that find out the common multiple so like this we have done now write seven multiple of 12 means 12 multiplied by 7 will be what multiple means multiply as you know that 9 multiply of 6 that 6 is multiplied by 9 12 multiply of 5 is 5 multiplied by 12 third multiple of 14 third means 3 multiply means multiply and 14 means 14 multiplied by 3 is what so this is a question is saying and uh, according to the table 12 sevens are 84 a6 nines are 54 5 twelves are 60 14 threes are 42 it will be the answer now you have to find out the factors of factors of 24 
suppose here is 24 so you have to find out that 24 comes in which um, tables now it comes in table of 1 1 multiplied by 24 is 24 2 2 multiplied by 12 we get 24 3 multiplied by 8 we get 24 4 multiplied by 6 we get 24 now uh, if you multiply again then 5 uh, in 5 table of 5 24 will not come but in table of 6 6 4 is 24 but at white versa you can write like this also you can write the, like this also so we will not just repeat it again so here is the factors now you can factors of 24 will be 1 2 3 4 6 8 12 and 24 these are the factors according to that we have done some question more also after that find the factors of each of the following pair and list the common factor common factor again that you have to first out find out find out the uh, factor and after that what is a common factor find the factors after that next question is common factor what is common which factor is common so you have to find out so this question we are going to take now 18 and 6 now what is the factor of 18 18 comes in which uh, table 1 18 is equal to 18 2 9 is 18 3 6 is 18 then in 4 of table table of 4 no 18 is coming 5 no 18 is coming 6 6 3 is 18 and now again it's vice versa so do no need to write it again accord like this 1 6 is 6 and 2 3 is 6 after that vice versa it's just so no need to write after that you can see if you write factors of 18 1 2 3 6 9 18 and what is the factor of 6 1 2 3 and 6 now you can find out the common factor common factor 1 is a common factor 2 it comes in both 3 is a common factor 6 is a common factor so these four are the common factors now divisibility rule again the divisibility rule that uh, what is a divisibility rule of 2 that last digit of one's place is even number once does it if the word last place of even number last digit of one place is even number so this is the it is divisible by 2 what is the divisibility of 3 sum of digits must be multiple of 3 means if you add 5 plus 1 is 6 and 5 plus 1 is 6 and you can say 3 2s are 6 so it is multiple of 3 addition then after that multiple of 3 sum of digit must be multiple of 3 last digit 0 or 5 if the last digit is 0 or 5 it is divisible by 5 this is divisibility rule of 5 last two digit divisible by 4 if the last two digit is divisible by 4 so you can say this is divisible by 4 number divisible by 2 and 3 what is the rule of 3 means for 6 means is the number is divisible by if the number is divisible by 2 and 3 so that number is divisible by 6 also now divisibility rule of 9 sum of digit must be multiple of 9 if you add it you can see that number 9 plus 9 18 and 18 plus uh, 8 26 and 20 plus 6 plus 1 7 27 now 27 here is 27 9 3 is a 27 so this is divisibility rule of 9 according to this question some digits are given you have to find out now the prime number numbers that have only two factors are called prime numbers two two is having two number that is one and two seven one and seven thirteen thirteen comes in uh, no not any table so one and thirteen these three these digits are not comes in any table it comes only the table of one and also the table of itself so these are called the prime numbers Composite number, number that have more than two factors are called 
composite numbers if they have more than two number two factors means four four uh, is the factor of one two four eighteen one two three six eight eight nine eighteen in these tables these digits will come so these are called the composite numbers one is neither a prime number and not a composite number one is a unique number two is even prime number now factor tree what is factor tree it is very easy factor tree is what suppose any number is given suppose 32 is given so 32 is given so what you have to done now here 32 you can see 2 is an even number so we will start from 2 so if you divide 2 to 32 you will get 16 if you divide 2 to 16 you will get 8 if you divide 2 from 8 you will get 4 if you divide 4 to 2 you will get 2 so factor of 32 is 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 now this is your factor tree that's all for the day. Thank you.